Hello everyone, it's Farkad here. And in this episode, I'm going to be building a fortification, a base of sorts. And I'll have to break it up because I've got to go out soon. I've been so busy of late. Now, where I want to build it is actually over the top of this. Actually, no. Over this pond, I'll do it. Yep. So I've got to start collecting logs and stuff. So I'm going to be cutting down trees. I'm going to be blowing them up. And this dynamite. Find a good cluster. I really don't feel like cutting down trees manually. I can be quite uh, liberal <laughs> with uh, the amount of dynamite I use. Oh, I didn't get this one. I didn't want you were supposed to go down. Gotta start putting them away, otherwise I'll start despawning. If you want to know the best trick with log farming is just to use dynamite. I mean, the chainsaw's good and all. Same with the modern axe, but meh. Dynamite just does it so much better and so much faster. That's a deer. Pretty sure I'm still looking for them. I haven't been playing much, so... Can't even remember! Ah! You know what I was thinking about the other day? Was, um... Whether catching rabbits and breeding them is actually worth it. Uh, it's not really. Unless you're into hardcore decorating. It just becomes more of a nuisance. And they slow down the game a lot, because it's a lot of animations going on. That was a zombie right there. Zombie. Uh, hello. Nah, no, better not. This one. Hello. Stop moving. It's always going to be a hassle. My little stick cart versus a dynamite. And she's fine. I actually don't put them on trees very often because it's not as effective. you got to find around the middle of a group of trees. And often a tree isn't in the middle of what you're trying to target. I should check my calories. I bet you they're under. God. Ah, I'm terrible at maintaining that. Oh, I've got heaps of fresh meat here too. I wonder what will happen. Put a dry and rack in the middle of a lake. I'll probably still go for it. Oh, I should really get that deer, eh? It went over its head. Ah, there we go. Oh no, I can't put meat on it. <laughs> but that actually makes sense. You can't dry meat if it's in the water. It's unlike the forest developers to do that. Uh, yucky, yucky leg. Yeah, always put your meats away before picking up a deer, because any spare meat that you can't carry gets wasted. It just disappears, mate. I know these are useless, and I'm going to build one for the first time I think I've ever built one in any of my seasons. A fish trap. That'll do. Why are they just staring at me? I was just complaining about food, and I didn't even eat anything. <laughs> Uh, you take a break from something for long enough, you do forget things. you got to stay on your game. Should really be collecting water, but I've got no turtle shell. Oh, I'm broke. Sticks. Always need some. Lots of sticks and berries and logs here, which is good. It's neato, mate. Neato. Get the rope from here. Yeah, I was going to build on top of it, but the elevation is quite steep there. It's not going to work with what I've got planned. I don't have an upgraded spear, and I don't have any bones. So I have to destroy these manually. <laughs> Silly bird. So you're having that little bit extra athleticism at the start. God, it's so useful, eh? So what you need to do is measure what a rock wall height is off the ground. And go from there. Okay, so this is a bit lost. So I'm going to do it from here. Uh, say there. I want save. Uh, let's put this here. Ah, uh, friends. Oh, yeah, still got it. Time to sleep. There we go. Is my meat dried yet? Should be. Yep. After live on soda. That's fine. Now, i just got to burn these and not forget that I burnt them. I don't want to lose their bodies. Okay. This is just a rough drawing that I've done. So it doesn't really matter how accurate it is. Okay, I don't want it to join up to that stupid thing it does. Ah. My bones are done. 
can make that upgraded spear I've been yearning for, mate. Yeah, I should cancel it and start over. Alright, so I'm covered in blood. Easy to sort that out. So the trick is, do it this way. Place it on there. Place that. And that. And wait for it to snap. And connect it up. Run back over. So... And done. Got no freaking rocks. What? Go away. Got a log cart somewhere that had no logs in it, but I guess I lost it. <gasps> oh well. Oh, there it is, right there. <laughs> God, I'm an idiot. Okay, need to see if this is going to attach. Yep, yeah, that's good enough. It should work. So another one. It's going too high. Now I can cancel all these. I can actually cancel the foundation too. Custom floor. Yep. Oh, I don't like how thin that is. Hopefully it's going to be fine. The joys of building or getting attacked. There we go. Oh, can use this tree stump. It's actually useful for something. Defensive wall. As we now know... They are the strongest wall. I swear to God that's trying to clip in. I don't even know why. Let's see. I don't want any of them hanging down. Ah, right, good enough. I'm gonna save just in case they destroy my floor while I'm in the middle of building it. Ah, oh, I've really gotta change this to the... Ah, oh, that'll do. No, not that. I just got the stick out again. God, they really dropped the ball on that, eh? I like the crafting mat, but god, they've flooded it with so many items. It's so hard to select so many of the freaking things in the game. Jumping jackaroos! Should really be aiming for headshots, but I don't want to lose my bolts. Good, piss off. I'm in the middle of something. This probably isn't the best time to be doing this. Ah, uh, it's glitching out. Damn it. Left a piece on there. Ah. Oh. Gotta be careful my log cuts. You only got 20 cuts to do this in, so... And this glitching out thing's pissing me off. Yeah, I can't tell if it's gonna cut it, and I've got a long way to go. I don't think I've got any logs on the ground. No. Alright, I'm gonna reload and see if that fixes it. There we go, that's better. I can actually see what I'm doing. See what I'm cutting. I can't really leave any pieces behind. Mmm. I maxed out my cuts. Far out, that's so annoying. And game's running so slow. Seriously, it's taking like about 45 seconds just to get in the main menu. Let's try that again. This time I'm going to try it from up here. Ah, uh, it's too hard to tell. Oh, please give me one more cut. Please, man. Ah, oh, thank God. Don't ever make it that big, it's too, too risky. I need to protect this very well because that's holding up that wall. Now, the cool part, but also the frustrating part, is that you can put a wall underneath it, but lining it up if you want it exact is the hard part. Oh no, stop! Not now! It's hard to tell if it's... Oh, it's way off. Oh, that looks pretty spot on, actually. There's a case of lining up like that. And then moving it over. Please don't. No. 
Ah, oh, so close. Jesus. Good enough. Imagine if I did all that and they <laughs> sit there wailing on this. <laughs> Bastards. Alright, time to start building it. Um, oh, it's almost dead in the middle. Oh, I should eat something. Oh, I should be eating my meats, but I cannot be stuffed. If you're wondering if this provides you with any more protection, uh, it might, but not really. Oh, uh, yeah, it would actually, because they won't be able to fit under here. Except for in places like here, they'd probably be able to fit. The thing is, you don't really want them to get in to begin with. Probably never going to get it absolutely exact. It would be too difficult. But the benefit of this is that you could actually put a custom floor up the top behind it and have a walkway around your walls. Because if you can do that with what I've done there, you could easily do that. Put a walkway around it. Oh, I should have taken the log carts around here. Because there's no logs down here. <sighs> Get your weapon out. Should have changed this over ages ago. And still got you, son. Okay, so I've got no more logs. So what I'm going to do, and this is part of me playing to the best of my ability. I'm out of destruction mode. Off. Yeah, the dynamite. I'm going to blow this all towards the... Building. So I don't have to deal with blowing up my own crap. Grab the other dynamite just here. Yeah, I just don't want to destroy my own stuff. Usually I'd probably clear all the forest around it. I mean, if you're able to get it up exact, so it matched exactly, it wouldn't look glitched at all. I mean, it looks a little bit glitched there, but that's because I've aligned it probably too well. Probably should have placed the top one a little bit further behind. I don't know, it depends if it bothers you or not, but you might not like this idea anyway. So there you go. Yeah, I'll just put it on there. Trees. But this definitely gives it a more fortress feel. I'm liking it already. Oh, this is annoying. You know, if they weren't going to fix the game, right? Finish fixing it. Like the log cart bug that shoots you up into the air. They at least could have added a parachute to the game. What are you doing, doofus? I can't see anything, it's so dark. Ah, oh, that'll do. I'm save and sleep. I'll put them down here. Because then they're easier to see, I won't forget about them. Where'd his legs go? And his arms? I don't remember taking them off. That's just bits of them falling off now. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, this game's great. It really is. <laughs> Maybe one of the deer came along and ate some of them. Yeah, this is really annoying. Sh should have completed the gate last. Oh, need to make up some armor. You know, if they had cloth respawning here, this place would be everything you need. Well, this is heaps of rope here. Can I grab all the logs? I think I did. Oh, I need to eat, man. Oh, I should eat meat. I'm only eating it off the rack just to make sure it's dry. Usually I don't. There's a bug. I still haven't caught any fish. Jesus Christ. Trap's so useless. Still got build instruction mode off, so. Booms. And the way falling trees can destroy buildings is stupid. Like, I've seen trees miss structures and destroy them. I've seen trees land on structures and not destroy them. Stupid. You know what you could do is, if you wanted to take out a section, you could put a catapult there. Oh, not take it out, but change it to a door. And then you open the door and there'll be a catapult behind the door. I think that'd be pretty cool. No way, Fogget. Find a road tree that's out of dynamite distance. Ah, oh, this'll do. There's a deer. There's a log cart. Ah, there we go. And the beauty of that, that's perfectly level with the earth, if that makes sense. So, I can put a custom floor all the way around and it'll be the exact same height as the top of the wall. Yeah, I can fit through there easy. Can I take a log cart through there? Easy. Should be able to. Yeah. Now, if you want to put these things on it, 
These aren't going to be a lined level. They're going to be aligned with the ground. If you put them up top, they'll look all right. Uh, I don't know. I'm going to leave it for now. I've still got a lot of wall to build. Might drop some battle plans. So, about a rock wall's height. That'll be fine. The bottom wall will still go up high enough. Only just so. The thing is, how far do I want to build out? Have another wall here. And I'll connect it up here. Yeah, it looks good. Plenty of room for building, I think. Probably going to cost a lot too. I really like it, eh? It's got a much scarier look to it, like, don't come in here, otherwise you'll get fucked up. Which isn't really true if they come in there. <laughs> They're probably going to fuck me up, so... <laughs> Just can't win, mate. Um... Hmm, this might be an issue. I could use that. Let's try it. And then I'll wrap up the episode, because I've got to go. I was planning on splitting it up, but I thought, nah, I could get this done. Yeah, it's poking through the wall, so what would end up happening is when I place the custom floor, it's going to poke through the wall. It's only a small section, though, so I'm going to do it. Oh, I'm going to cancel this, because it's a rough design. Oh, man, give me the blueprint. There we go. I remember a patch that they released. It was a long time ago. Makes blueprints easier to place things on. Yeah, that was a lie. Oh, cancel all these blueprints. There's a lot of them too. Don't ever worry if cannibals are hitting on your walls. They can't destroy them. It looks like they're damaging them, but they're doing like 0.001 damage to them. Holy sh shit. There's a lot, man. I've got a plan. <gasps> and I've got to make it work. If I throw the dynamite, they're going to run away from it. All we can do is use a tree stump. Just need to get a whole bunch around me. Here we go. Oh, I was hoping that would knock him over. Piss off. Oh, hello. Oh. Oh, that's my aim. There we go. <laughs> she dodged the arrow. <laughs> he didn't. Go away. I must be getting low on arrows, man. I'm missing a lot. I just had a thought. I don't really need modern arrows. If you're going for headshots all the time... Oh, jeez. You don't need that extra damage, because it's going to kill them anyway. Wow, dude. <laughs> that freaking lighter thing. <laughs> oh, man. Stupid birds. Who needs a birdhouse? Okay. Quickly, 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 quickly. <gasps> oh no. Alright, so here's an issue. You're probably going to have to place it along each wall separately. Oh. Jeez, man. Oh, I'm not dodging well today. Stop attacking me. Yeah, because the way it goes, when it goes lengthways, it looks like garbage. I don't even think of that. There's my bones. E bones. Yeah, so that ain't gonna work. I don't even know if it'll look any good too. It kinda looks funny. Ah, oh, more of you guys. That's in your eye. She's climbing a tree. Get down out of there. Oh! <laughs> don't think the game's really meant for doing that. Uh... <laughs> I don't know what happened there. <laughs> yeah, you don't really need strength anymore. Get good with the crafted bow and you're set. Bottom bow's okay, but crafted bow's where's that? You just shoot so much faster. It's like pew pew. Oh crap, I totally forgot. I recorded an episode where I went and got all the blueprints, but it was really boring and I thought, I've done this so many times and I've made so many videos on it. It's like, I don't need to keep making videos on the things that I keep doing. So, yeah. Yeah, it was just a lot of travelling. Might start loading up on sticks. That's one bone short. No! Stop! Oh! Another tree climber. Oh, I can't even aim my bow up that high. <laughs> I reckon that should kill him instantly. Falling out of a tree like that. 
Yeah, they're just coming not stop. Now, just thought of an issue. If you did it section by section, you might struggle with alignment. But I think I can make it work. Try that. I only have to build up one. Alright, so I can cancel these. The reason I'm doing it this way is that the enemies actually hit through walls. So you can't place things behind walls. And if you place that rock pillar behind a wall, they could knock out your platform. Chances of them going for that exact spot and doing that, pretty low. But it's not something I really want to have to deal with. Or you could glitch it so it floats up and you can place it on top. Oh no, it's here. There we go. And that shouldn't be on the other side. Yep, it's not. It looks like a good height that I could poke my head over. This should be cheap to build. Eight logs. That's pretty good. Gonna sleep. Oh, it finally caught a fish. <laughs> I've got no more dynamite left. No! Alright, it's done. I don't really need to cut this off. Oh, it's doing that thing again. So I'm not going to do that. You just need a way to get up there too, but I was going to build... Probably going to build stairs. Actually, I'll wrap up the episode now, because I've done enough. I'm going to do log farming before I do this again, because otherwise it's just more for me to have to edit. Alright, build hack on. <gasps> I didn't turn on things. I wonder if that would work. I'll just place one like that. <gasps> oh no! Let's try this. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this is cool. Can't really shoot through it, though. Oh, uh, maybe. I can't even jump on top of it. If you go one higher, or you could use a custom foundation to get the height adjustable. Uh, there's a lot of ways to do it, so... That's neat. It's good that you can't accidentally jump over it. It looks cool, too. Yeah. Anyway, that's enough for one episode. In the next one, I'm going to continue building on this, and I might try and find a way... Oh, no. It's realistic if it's like that, but I want to be able to shoot down from the walls, you know? They should add boiling oil to the game. That'll be cool. <laughs> uh, anyway, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers. Cheers.